Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a quick one box break. A nice one box break of 2023-24 Panini Donners Optic Basketball first off the line. Pick your team number six at the end. We'll randomize everybody's name. Someone's gonna chase the mantle. The purple stars are your exclusives in this first off the line set. So we're almost, after this one box break, we'll be halfway through the case. So thanks everyone for making this happen. There's a, sorry, I was using a different color font right there, but Brian H, Brian Heyman with Last Spot Mojo with the Grizz. Looks better when it's on the uh, main screen. All right, so we'll go one, two, three for the left stack, four, five, six for the right stack. Two, left stack right here. Then we'll go one, two, three, four. If I roll a five or a six, I'll roll again. Two again, so the second box down right here. So this is the one we're gonna do right here. And then for the next one box break, we'll just go top to bottom, one, two, three, four, five, six. We're halfway there. There's the first off the line sticker. And good luck. Rex, what's up? I know a lot of music you like, you know? Uh, like raised a lot of bands and were you ever a corn fan? No. Was not. Uh, not surprisingly, I'm a bit of a music snob, so mainstream rap metal like corn and limp biscuit are not gonna be in my uh, in my wheelhouse. What makes what makes Rage different? Are you really comparing them to to Corn and Limp Biscuit and uh, Lincoln Park bands of that ilk? They're very different. They're far more talented. Their message is far more clear. As controversial as it may be. But uh, but yeah, I, th I think they were they were definitely more purposeful, if you will. You know. and they have the uh, and they were superior musicians as well. Right, I did. Yeah, the Scott Reggae scene was pretty big here in Southern California. Mighty Mighty Boss Homes are all right. I probably listened to them more than I did Corn. I'll say that. I'll say that. Here's Victor Romanyama. This is uh, Juan with the Spurs. There you go. First of many in this one box break, I hope. Cypress Hill. No. Uh, they just didn't listen to a lot of Cypress Hill. Here's Ricky Council the fourth. They were a little too, too like late '80s, early '90s rap for me. By the time I was in a rap listening phase, you know, span, uh, or acts like Cypress Hill were a little outdated because you're listening to Dre, you're listening to Snoop Dogg, you're listening to Warren G. So there, there was so much quality hip hop coming out of Southern California, post 80s, early 90s hip hop that that was outdated by the time I started listening to, uh, to hip hop. It's Dante DiVincenzo to 249. Uh, the Ricky Council of the Fourth, did I mention the team? That's Sixers, by the way, that's gonna be for Tristan. 
43 out of 99, Lori Markinen. And there's Elite Dominators insert Victor Wembanyama. Another one for one. These add up. There's Amen Thompson. Houston Rockets, that's going to go to Isaac, Jaron Jackson Jr., Hollow. Come on, let's see some more low-numbered stuff here. Here's some orange to 199, Bilal Koulibaly, Andrew with the Wizards. It's Cam Whitmore, 68 out of 79. Rockets. It'll be for Isaac. There's a rated rookie, Brandon Miller. A red hot rookie is Derek Lively. Dallas, he had a nice playoff run. That's Tristan. Brandon Miller for Charlotte, also for Tristan. Base rated rookie, Brandon Miller. Kelly Obrey Jr., Lime Green, 61 out of 149. Tristan with the Sixers. Rising Suns, Trey Young. Does he stay on, on Atlanta? And we got an Elite Dominators Hollow, Brandon Miller. That's better. Here we go. Tristan, Charlotte. Trey Young Orange to 199. Cade Cunningham, there's your uh, purple stars, 15 out of 17. Detroit, that's going to be for Tristan. This one's exclusive to the first off the line. Trey Young to 199. We got Steph Curry, Rising Suns Hollow. Sessenbaugh and Swather Hollow. All right, and there you have it. A lot of great stuff here. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with me. Now, who's going to win at that Chase the Mantle spot? Let's flip back over here. Let's gather everybody's names. One through 30. New dice, new list. Name on top after three and a one four times. Fingers crossed. Good luck. Two, three, and once more, fourth and final time. 29 sad spots, but one happy spot. Who's that happy person gonna be? It's not Tristan. Sorry, Tristan, close, not quite. Two through 30, sad time. Whether, whether you're, if you're not first, you're last. Right, <laughs> they say it in, uh, in that uh, Ricky Bobby movie. Uh, Talladega Nights. If you're not first, you're last, so it doesn't really matter. Two is the same as 30. 30 is the same as two after four. But the winner, an entry to chase the mantle, Benjamin. There you go, Ben. I don't know if I could, yeah, there weren't too many warriors. Maybe that hollow rising sun Steph Curry, but uh, but nothing really, no, no Pazemskis or anything like that. But an entry to chase the Mickey Mantle. Good luck. I'm Joe. I'll see everyone next time for the next break. Bye-bye.